like to welcome you to another episode of Mission Matters. My name is Adam Torres, and if you'd like to apply to be a guest of the show, just head on over to missionmatters.com and click on Be Our Guest to Apply. All right, so today's a very special day. I'm in Washington, D.C. for the Power Up Conference 2024. We're also celebrating Women's Equality Day. We're celebrating a Mission Matters book launch. We got a whole lot to talk about. Um, but first off, we have Rosser on the show. Thank you so much for coming on. So good to see you. It's great to see you, Adam. Thanks for putting all this together. This is wonderful. All right. So um, we're here to celebrate the conference. I know you've been, I believe, to conferences in the past. Am I off on that? How did you originally get, get introduced to the Power Up Conference and, and the, the whole network? I love that question because it really has been career changing, life changing in many ways. Mm. So back in 2017 in LA, I kept getting these emails to either nominate myself or nominate somebody else for 50 women can change the world in media and entertainment. Mm. And it was all from Take the Lead, which I hadn't heard of. On a whim, I decided to nominate myself and then I got in and that was my initiation into Gloria Felt's programs, and they're really life changing. Yeah. So you went to the conference last year. You've been through some of the trainings as well. Like, tell me a little bit about what you've gotten out of this. I know I, that's a big question. It is. I know. <laughs> it is because I've gotten so much out of it. Yeah. You know, there was the first cohort, and then last year at this conference, when it was in Los Angeles, mm -hmm. I went, I was on the panel for the entertainment cohort, and I just, I looked around the room, mm -hmm. women and men mm -hmm. supporting women in what felt like to me an indescribable way. Yeah. Something I'd always wanted and expected from like fifth grade on and actually could never find it. And it's been here, maybe not all along, but yeah. it's been here for the last decade or so, thanks to Gloria and all the people like her. And uh, I was inspired. I was so inspired uh, last year that for the newer cohort, mm -hmm. there have been many, but the one about to be launched a year ago was 50 Women Can Change the World in Entrepreneurship. Mm -hmm. So I was like, I'm going to nominate myself for that. And I actually was invited and got a whole new experience. Wow. Yeah. What would you say to those that have like the other women or men out there that like about participating, coming to this conference? Like why would, why would you tell them they should be here? Well, I have told many people they should be here. And from my standpoint, I've said the support for each other, the genuine support, which kind of don't see a lot in Hollywood yeah. and I'm sure other industries, but it's so deep and so rich and so heartfelt and very actionable. Mm -hmm. Like there's there's not just words, there's you know walking the walk. Mm -hmm. And Gloria Felt does it, everyone I've met in the cohorts yeah. and conferences have done it and do it. And it, it's really helped me up level you know, as someone to help others and to see myself in definitely a more successful light. Yeah. And we had a little bit of uh, we, we went to a, a meetup. So we got a little bit of a talk and I want I want you to bring some of that to the interview. So good for the audience, because obviously they weren't with us. And more, to be very specific, it was about you thinking about like you went to the conference, you've been you were part of one of the cohorts. And then all of a sudden, when you're talking about leveling up, that even took you further into your ideation process sure. of creating what your current business. Ta give Give me a little bit of that. OK. It's so exciting. So last year at this event in Los Angeles, when I heard about the next cohort for entrepreneurial women, mm -hmm. I'm a filmmaker, always been a filmmaker. That's what I do. Mm -hmm. However, I was so, I found it so enticing, this this next cohort. I was like, okay, okay, okay. I have to think of an idea. <laughs> yeah. And it's like, well, it's not gonna be a film. You know, I've done all these things a million times. It's not gonna be my production company. Mm -hmm. It's not necessarily going to be real estate. And I was like, okay, what is it? And then it's it's just all world together. Mm. And it's philanthropic film finance. And I founded the company mm -hmm. Tano Rising Film. Mm -hmm. And I never would have thought of it if I didn't, if I hadn't been there last mm -hmm. year and if I hadn't 
become part of the the entrepreneurial cohort. Yeah. So it just it took the both the best of both worlds for me. It took film, you know, twenty five years of experience in that, mm -hmm. and then my business acumen, but giving it somewhere to go. Mm -hmm. And so for me, all of this wasn't just about starting a company or another yeah. company. It was about solving a lot of problems in the independent uh, film space in terms of uh, what I'm. I'm one of the sad filmmakers that goes through. You know, the ringer and just watching us all go through the ringer all the time. I wanted to flip the script on that and come up with something mm -hmm. that uh, was leveling up us, you know, uh, film it internally, externally. So that's how Tiana Rising film was born philanthropic film finance. So mm -hmm. if you go to the site, it'll explain it all, but yeah. it's uh, very exciting. Well, Rosser, I know we got a whole lot to do here. The conference is just getting started, yeah. a bunch of other things. Um, last thing I want you to do, I want you to look into the camera and tell everyone how they can follow you. Give them the website oh. again. Give them all of that because I want everybody to go check it out. Okay. Thank you so much. Um, yes. So my name is Rosser Goodman, R-O-S-S-E-R. -S -S -E it's a little different. And the new company I'm talking about is called Tano Rising dot Film, And Tano is T A. N O, mm -hmm. the word rising dot film. And that's really the best place to find me right now. And LinkedIn. Yeah. I'm on LinkedIn as, you know, my name, Ross or Goodman. So those are the two best ways to find me. Perfect. And for everybody that's watching, just so you know, we'll put the links in the show notes so that you can just click on them and head right on over. And speaking of the audience, if this is your first time with Mission Matters and you haven't hit the subscribe or follow button yet, uh, we welcome you to do that because this is a daily show. Each and every day I'm bringing you new interviews, new content, new entrepreneurs, and hopefully new inspiration that's going to help you along the way in your journey as well. So again, hit that subscribe or follow button. And Rosser, again, thank you so much for coming on. Thank really you, Adam. This guy right here. Awesome. Okay.